Well, I think the big problem is to imagine that there is a starting point of anything, or even that the starting point is actually relevant. I usually start out by finding images that I feel like copying or using as a storyboard, but this actually probably doesn't have anything to do with the final work. It gives it a really strict outline and an aesthetic coherence and integrity and a rigour. And it also helps the dancers have something to work from. But I also feel that for the audience to know what that path was is to let the cat out of the bag a bit. What's more interesting is to see what is there at the end and what does it look like. And for me, it's the biggest surprise to see what comes out at the end because it's completely unpredictable. It's got nothing to do with the images or my starting point. This is quite an unusual piece for a contemporary dance person to embark on. It doesn't look like anything I was expecting to make. It's a very difficult piece of work. The cues in the music being played backwards is incredibly difficult. So if the dancers weren't up for it and weren't up for doing something very hard, um, I would have discarded this way of working. But they've encouraged me by their attention to detail and their enthusiasm. So I think my experience here has been that I've made a really difficult and bonkers piece of work because I've been encouraged to do so by a group of people who are really up for doing something very different, something that didn't look like any other piece of work that they've been in before. So I think that speaks for itself. I think now looking at the work that we've made, it's almost like a strange, concentrated, backwards, inside out, through the looking glass opera that's been done by people that have never seen an opera, who've read about it in a book and are making their own opera. So it bears no resemblance to anything, but it feels slightly familiar. It's episodic and it flows from one thing to another and there is a coherent aesthetic style. But what is it about is for the audience to get because I have no idea.